everyone and welcome back to my channel. Now first thing is excuse how my hair looks today. It's kind of being a bit weird. I'm not sure what's wrong with it but it's kind of just looking a little bit gross. I kind of curled it and of course the curls last for about three seconds once I've straightened my hair and yeah it's just not looking great so we're going to ignore it today. But I'm here to do a kind of little mini haul for you and I will first of all confess that I was actually sent these things but I wanted to come on here and show them for to you because it's from a brand that I had never heard of before and it's kind of Asian beauty products and the brand is called Beautique and they do some really really cool different brands they do different kind of skincare they have a lot of like BB creams on there which I know a lot of people are fans of but I picked a few of the makeup items and I have also got a discount code for you so stay tuned for that but I'm just going to show you what I got sent. I picked them and everything so it's just kind of like a little haul that um, I will obviously full disclosure I didn't pay for but I wanted to kind of be able to try these different brands so I could talk to you about them because that's half the fun of it. So the first thing is actually something I'm wearing today and this is by a brand that I've heard a lot about and it's Tony Moly and it's the Petite Bunny Gloss Bar and one of the things that are worth mentioning are the packaging of most of these things is amazing. I mean how cute is that with the little ears and the smiley face it's just so sweet and it's just a gloss bar and the thing that's unusual about this is the shape of it it's just kind of flat it's got no kind of serrated lip shaped nib which I find quite interesting I'm wearing it today I really like it it's very similar to the Revlon lacquer balm in Coquette which is one of my favorites it's very similar to that and it's just a kind of nice pretty pink shade very natural I've got very kind of natural makeup on today anyway and I really like that then another lip product I've got in here is a lipstick and this was actually quite surprising it's the Innisfree Colour Glow Lipstick and I got it in the shade, I want to say it was called Black Tea um, but obviously all the writing is not in English so I don't know what that says but it looked like more of a kind of peachy nude on there it's actually more of a kind of bright corally orange shade which is fine because it's gorgeous as well packaging looks like this which I think is really sweet and then the lipstick is that shade so it's a kind of nice summery spring colour. Really gorgeous texture, it's very glossy and just looks like it'll be really nice on the lips. I haven't used that yet though. Then I've got a brow product that I'm wearing today as well and this is um, by Etude House, I have heard of this brand on YouTube before actually and it's their Colour My Brows and it's basically a similar concept to the Give Me Brow by Benefit. I'm wearing this in my brows today and I got it in the shade um, number one rich brown and it's a little bit warmer than I would like I think the benefit one and um, the dark shade is perfect for me this is a little bit warm but I can make it work and the nib the brush of this is very interesting because as you can see it's kind of got a thicker part down the middle and then it tapers they suggest that you kind of comb it through your brows and then use the little nib to kind of make the um, brows kind of a little bit more tidy looking but I find that you get too much product build up on the tip of the brush to do that so I just kind of brushed it through my brows and don't know how well you can see I think they look really nice it kind of gives a nice defined look and I really like it and then I have a complexion product here and this is from the same brand as the lipstick and it's the no sebum mineral powder and it says it has um, natural original mint in it and it does have a slight fragrance which is quite cool it's got a slight sweet mint scent to it I like the packaging of this I think the color is really pretty that kind of mint blue color and I use this to set my makeup today it's translucent it's completely completely translucent and it was very nice it kind of did um, feel very light on the skin, the scent's nice and it doesn't look too powdery which I like as well so I'll keep you posted on that because I've only used it once so I'll see how it helps to mattify my skin during the day. And then what else do we have? We have a mascara here that I haven't used there yet and this is the Loi L, I'm really not sure how to pronounce this and it's the Dollish Mascara. I'm not going to open this until I've used up the tens of thousands of mascaras I've got lurking around my drawers. But um, I have heard very good things about Asian mascaras, so I'm really intrigued. And 
this is what the packaging looks like. The packaging is really cute. It's kind of just very kitsch and pretty, I find, a lot of the packaging. So I really am looking forward to using that. And I'll link down the website so you can have a look at kind of um, the brush and that kind of thing. And it's best for lengthening, it says. So I really want to try that. And then I've got two complexion products. First one is by um, Holika Holika. That's so cute. And it's called Hello Holika. Is that what it's called? I don't know because that's the only thing it literally says on the package in English. But it is a blusher slash highlighter. The packaging is really nice. It kind of, once you get it in the light, you see that it's not actually black. It's kind of like a gorgeous shimmery purple. And so this is what it looks like. And I think it is so so pretty so it's just got this little kind of cap print it's very shimmery the shades kind of aren't um necessarily the most flattering the kind of lilac and that kind of thing but it's just a very very pretty th thing and i think it would be gorgeous as a gift for a younger girl i mean the packaging of that is just gorgeous and then last but not least i have got a kind of shimmer brick type of product which I think is very very interesting and this is from Tony Moly again I think I'm pronouncing that right I'm probably saying all these names wrong but this is just what the packaging looks like and then in here you just get these kind of goldy shimmer shades so you can use them as eyeshadows pigmentation is really nice you can use them as eyeshadows you could use them as a highlighter they'd be really nice during the summer I think and I think that it comes, oh no, does it? It sounds like there's something in there that like this part would open. Let me see. Mm, maybe not, I thought that kind of bit there opened and maybe you had a brush in there, but that's not the case. It comes with a nice big mirror as well. So that is everything that I picked and I'm looking forward to trying it. As I said, I've got some of the things today. The lip um, kind of well, I want to say the glossy stick type of thing. It's really lovely. It's really comfortable on the lips and it just feels really kind of like a treatment almost. But I hope you enjoyed this video and the discount code that I've got will give you 10% off your order and the code is going to be right here in the video. There's going to be a little annotation for the code and I'm obviously going to put it down below as well. So make sure you go and check out the website and let me know what you've tried from there. And I'd be really interested interested to know what kind of um, other foreign beauty brands you've tried because this has kind of opened my eye to a whole new world of products which are really intriguing. So I would really love to hear your thoughts on the matter and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!